The character you got in the bad end was inspired by what I saw in a lot of messages of the fans who are in this game and by people I see in the comments of not only your videos but on Tumblr, Twitter, DeviantArt, Facebook. I know you will never see this message. I'm sorry if this message bother you, bothers you. Some people feel like they do not contribute at all to any community or they are insignificant to the YouTuber, A, the YouTuber and B, the fan base because they never made it into a vlog or never got to talk to you, their inspirations face to face. They think they don't matter and that is one of the saddest things ever, or at least to me. It also, it, sorry. It also gets to me in a big way as well because I get, I get so many messages from people saying you're never gonna read this message or you never reply to my messages or them feeling like they don't matter to anybody and that really breaks my heart because you guys really do matter to me, not just to me, but to the community as a whole. Like just being here, being on the channel, watching every day, commenting, liking, sharing with your friends, just being on Tumblr or Twitter or anything, interacting with everybody else. It means so much more than you think it does. You might feel like it doesn't and I'm so sorry if I never reply to your messages or you've been subscribed since I had 10 subscribers and I've never like so reply to anything. I try my very best to get to as many people as I can. It's so hard a lot of the time because there's so many of you and I'm I'm very happy about that but just please know that I never ignore people. It's never a case of seeing the messages and purposefully not replying. I read as many as I can. I read a lot more than I actually get time to reply to. So just know that I've likely seen your message. I just can't reply to it. So Thank you to everybody who's ever done anything for me, whether it, even the people who hate me, who have just come to the channel and watched for five seconds. Just thank you for at least clicking on the channel or anything at all. Thank you all for being here. I really, I really don't know what I'd ever do without any of you anymore. Because I'm so used to like waking up every day and like going on Tumblr, going on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram and just seeing messages from people on YouTube as well. And I'm, I've gotten so accustomed to that, that, I, I don't know, I don't take it for granted. I, I mean, I guess I do in a small bit. Like, if that ever just disappeared, I'd be so lost. I wouldn't know what to do, I'd, I'd feel so alone. Because, I like, I don't interact with people on a day-to-day -day basis in real life. I go out, I go to the shop or whatever, I, like, buy food. But I never actually, like, sit down with friends anymore. I don't have any friends that I meet like day to day or talk to or anything like that. All my interactions are based online through you guys or through other YouTube friends. So just thank you for being there for me. Like you guys say that I'm there for you all the time and I really I'm very happy about that. But you guys are there for me as well every day and you say so so much nice things to me. Even like in this there were so many nice messages for me and I can't believe that we're already at like 4 million subscribers and it it, it blows my mind all the time. I never expected any of this kind of stuff and I'm so happy about it. Like, not only to have like 4 million subscribers, but I have 4 million amazing subscribers. Any- like, anybody can act like an idiot and maybe get to 4 million subscribers. It's- it's a very hard thing to do, but a lot of people do have 4, four million subscribers on YouTube, but they don't have as nice people on their channel as there are here. There's very few channels on YouTube who have as nice a community as we do here. And, like, I, I'm not taking any credit for that. That's all because of you guys. It really is. You guys are really nice to each other, always talking to each other all the time, and listening to one another. And it's very rare for me to go into the comments anymore and see absolutely awful comments. So, thank you guys so much. I'm gonna leave the video here because it's, it's almost an hour long that I've been recording. I still don't know if I'm gonna split it up and just, like, make shift some intros and outros. I might just leave it all as one because I know people like the longer videos and I don't want to split it up. Um, I'm I'm very glad that I got to a lot of the stuff at the end and saw all the messages. I really hope I didn't miss any of the messages at the end. Oh no. That would really break my heart if that was the case. Um, I'll go back and I'll check maybe and add them in afterwards if I did miss any but... Thank you so much. You'll never know how grateful I am because I can never put it into words. As long as I live, I'll never be able to put it into words how grateful I am for this stuff. And I'm sorry if I've kind of gone off the rails lately with um, certain types of games and certain types of commentary. I'll try bring it back to these kind of things where it's longer and just more in touch with me. Where you get to know more about me, you get to listen to me 
a lot longer. It's not just all about dick jokes and like super highly edited stuff all the time. Um, I know a lot of you really like these longer videos that are uncut and I'm sorry if I like let some of you down. <laughs> sorry. <sighs> I'm sorry if I like if people thought I was going off in a bad direction like playing stuff like Honey Pop or anything like that. I, I'm, I'm really not trying to um, like be all about boobs and that kind of thing and stupid jokes. I, I thank you guys just so much for being here. I'm putting up on my sh Oh, he was real. <laughs> I was really hoping all that time it wasn't real, that it was just a story. That's so sad. <laughs> you look like such a happy little boy. <laughs> That's the face of mischief right there. That's a child who has done <laughs> scandalous little things. was a Kickstarter game either. I literally knew like almost nothing about it. I just started playing it and I read the description on Steam and that was it. The, the title of the game sounded interesting, the description sounded interesting, the screenshots looked really pretty. I knew it would probably have a very important message to send. Oh. That ruined me. <laughs> and then I didn't know it was a true story either. Which is so sad. That somebody comes into the world and they're not here for that long and they have to go through so much suffering with one of the worst afflictions that can happen to a person. And you get to... You get to experience and love and appreciate this little small person and then they're taken away from you so fast. Heck, Jack, do you have a proposal speech prepared for Mark? Heart, heart, heart. <laughs> Does anybody have a question? A question? 
I thought you were just begging for this the whole time. No, so no, now's no. your chance. No. Oh dear heart. That guy's a minister too. You proud of me, Mom? Why are you crying? Will you please share your subscribers with me for the rest of our lives? <laughs> no, 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 If I have to shoot someone, it's going to have to be Kenny. I'll fucking kill you! I knew you would! Ah, oh, balls! Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Oh. <laughs> Even though their bodies have long since returned to dust, their sacrifice still lives on. We must strive to cherish their memory and never forget. <laughs> Why do you have to die? And he died thinking that Carol was dead. Oh, fucking hell! Stupid game! I fucking, as soon as he said that he was sick, I knew that he was gonna die. Oh. And now I know why people said that I was gonna cry at the end. You were right! God damn it! <laughs> I, I, I don't have anything witty this time to say at the end, so... <laughs> I guess all I can say is thank you for watching, and bye.